Did you know that you can now aggregate data using logic extensions? Logic extensions are a key component of the JD Edwards extensibility framework. They enable non-technical business analysts as well as JD Edwards developers to use familiar syntax of Enterprise One event rules to create logic without the need for a development client and without the need to build and deploy a package. Logic extensions provide a no-code way to manipulate numerical, date and string data. Logic extensions can also read and write data to Enterprise One tables. This new feature will enhance the capabilities of logic extensions with the ability to aggregate data that is read from Enterprise One tables. And the best part is, you can accomplish this level of data analysis and manipulation without any programming skills. In addition to reading data from Enterprise One tables, logic extensions can now provide functions such as sums, averages, counts, and minimum and maximum values. These aggregated results can then be used in subsequent operations within the logic extension or passed as output to the next step in an orchestration. Let's consider a simple scenario. Suppose you want to provide a monthly bonus of 5% to the salesperson with the highest sales for the month. You can create a logic extension to query the Enterprise One database and return the employee ID for the maximum value of sales data, query the database for that employee's salary, and then multiply that value by 0.05 to calculate the bonus. Wasn't this easy? This new capability to aggregate data extends the JD Edwards logic extension feature to meet new business requirements and opportunities. You can now leverage built-in data analytics capabilities within the JD Edwards Enterprise One system and simplify cases in which data needs to be summed, averaged, or otherwise aggregated. And you can accomplish all these without any programming skills. To learn more about how to aggregate data using logic extensions, visit learnjd.com. Thanks for watching.